As most of you know, I have been harshly critical of China's policy of launching rockets deep inside their own territory and near populated areas, and this time they seem to have paid the price in catastrophic fashion. And so I'm bringing you all the details I can, no background music, nothing flashy, just me getting really angry about this situation because this was no small rocket, as you can see. This was a ballistic missile. The Tianlong-3, a privately built rocket by a company called Space Pioneer, but come on, let's be honest here. Any private companies in China are heavily influenced by the government, otherwise they don't stay in business. We are talking about a nine-engine rocket capable of carrying 17 metric tons to low Earth orbit and 14 metric tons to sun-synchronous orbit. This rocket was supposed to be carrying out a static fire, and instead, as you can see, the first stage took off all by itself, the engine shutting off fairly early in the flight process, which is probably the worst thing they could have done, assuming that this was an intentional decision, because it left a lot of the fuel that was clearly still in the booster left over for a cataclysmic explosion at the end of the flight. Who knows how many people were in harm's way. It does seem to have crashed into a hill, but I can't imagine that there was nobody in the way of this rocket. And just so we're completely clear, this is where the rocket launched from. Gongji, Henan province. I mean, deep, deep inside Chinese territory with lots of populated areas all around the launch facility. One of the stupidest places that you could possibly launch a rocket unless you just don't give a damn about your own citizens, which is obvious that the Chinese government is taking this kind of position, and at some point, they have to be held accountable by their own people. Yes, it's an oligarchy. Yes, it's an absolutist type of government with virtually no freedoms. But at some point, the Chinese people have to get fed up with how little their government gives a damn about their safety. Nobody else in the world test rockets this irresponsibly. And hopefully there will be some kind of accounting for this particular accident because there were just too many people watching. I will keep you up to date. In the meantime, stay angry about space. <laughs>